Or do you want me to get married now? Like, if you want me to get married the next one month, two months, mm -hmm. I'll marry. There's somebody. In fact, there are people. I'll get married now. But it's meant to be back in your house in like six months' time because we'd we'll have divorced. And I'm coming back here. I'm coming back to this house. Because, you know, but I say another egg, see I'm about to eat. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. If it's your first time here, if you are new here, welcome to my channel. I'm Timmy Banjo and today I'm having a mukbang. <laughs> this is like my first and very official mukbang. I know I've done one before with my niece. I'll leave a link here if you haven't seen there was like an interview just talking to her, asking her adult, you know, children question. I have my lunch here. It's a swallow, egusi and this is not pound any and this is eba so i'm having egusi and eba hey and bokoto <laughs> there's bokoto here and i have my um watermelon smoothie and a bottle of water so this is going to be like a chit chat life updates blah 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 what's been going on what's been happening i don't think i've ever done a um what's been happening updates all those type of things ah oh god the heat in nigeria my god my god anyways i've never been off youtube for this long before except the time that i abandoned it hey jesus who is calling me guys i might be sweating in this video because this food is hot and the weather is hot and there's no light in my house i live in nigeria we don't have lights in nigeria <laughs> so don't be surprised <laughs> this bokoto needs to excuse me mm -hmm. so I, as i was saying i haven't been off youtube for this long this is about two weeks or ten days and i just want to give a live update on what's going on in my life And to be honest, nothing is going on in my life. <laughs> oh, I'm boring. <laughs> I'm still the boring. No, I'm not boring, but I've actually just been working. But aside work, nothing else is happening. And I might be thinking, uh, which type of work is they me doing? YouTube is not my only job. Oh. Hey. Let me even come and cobalize. So I also have a makeup studio where I take clients. I'm a makeup artist, so I do makeup for my clients. Home service studio makeup, whichever one it is. So I've been working back to back. I think this is a wedding season. Yes. Ah, I've been wondering. Hmm. This is actually the wedding season, so that's why. Yeah, a lot of um you know makeup appointments also i traveled all the way to my former school my where is my former school Covenant university we had or they had their convocation so i took on clients there and i couldn't say no because i had taken on clients for a very long time before corona and i couldn't say no to them else i don't think i would have traveled all the way there and that's the last time i'm doing convo makeup if you're out there watching this video hoping you book me for your convocation at covenant university it's not going to happen so sorry but what the hand <clears throat> what else has been going on if i want you if i have a boyfriend yet hmm the good news is <laughs> I don't I mean God is saving me for somebody special <sighs> by God's grace I know you are Yimu in there but Yimu not me God is saving me for somebody special and one day I will debut my boyfriend on this my amazing channel but till then you know we keep the fire burning we keep trusting in Jesus our Lord and Savior to provide us with a bay and a boo. <laughs> oh, 
also i've been trying to put out a lot of videos on my other channel because that channel what you are starved that channel is starved of content it's not like i don't have content too but to edit to upload sometimes i will edit just many upload them i know upload sometimes i will upload just for me to publish it can take me three weeks so i'm trying to be um active on that channel because i really need to grow that channel that's like my first business makeup has always been my first love so i'm trying to really grow that channel also i've been doing a lot of collabs so if you're interested in doing a collaboration with me if you're a vendor in lagos obviously if you're a vendor in lagos you tie gaily you have a show king you have um what else you're a bridal kosno you're a bridal vendor sham white wedding you have hair pieces whatever it is that you have mm -hmm. please reach out to me let's do collab i beg things are heating up really fast also and they're wondering if i cook this food or not it's not me that cook it too neither did i buy it and my mama make them that's what you get when you're still living with your parents be eating food anyhow like a thief be sleeping in the house no. see i'm enjoying my life oh. mm -hmm. I'm never in a hurry like, to move out of my parents' house at all. Hmm. It's never easy out there. Ah, people are trying to oh. In this Nigeria, <laughs> they're not banned Twitter again. <laughs> me, I'm not using VPN. You know, me, I'm a good citizen. They ban Twitter. I stop using Twitter. But I'm still getting Twitter notifications. So how is that happening? I don't know. Me, I'm not, I'm not using VPN. I'm not lying. And Twitter is like my number one app on my phone. You can imagine how I'm not miserable in Jesus' name. But you can imagine how I don't know. Devastated I am. I'm not devastated, it's just Twitter. We'll still see the Twitter news on Instagram, so I am sabi. So what do you think about the Twitter ban? Does it actually make sense? Do you think we are being, I don't even know, I don't want to say punished because are we children? Just doesn't make sense to me anyway, to many people. <laughs> but guess what? There are some people supporting that Twitter ban. And they are using Twitter to support the Twitter ban. Anyway, may I not say anything before they come and carry me? I mean, we are not here to talk about politics, so I have to talk about me myself and i so what else has been happening in my life i'm all this obstacle inside this food ah god god bless my mommy see if you are living with your parents hmm? open your two ear don't be in a hurry to move out hmm? for no reason should you be in a hurry to move out enjoy yourself enjoy your life hmm? stay there don't parent we don't pay lights bill. We don't pay DSTV bill. We don't buy food stuff. Hmm. Everything is free. I'm enjoying my life. All the money I'm making is my own. Eh? Except when I pay tax. Hmm. Please don't. I'm sure I want the people. Go easy. Go easy, Lara. The only way you can enjoy. This type of food is with your hand, honestly. Oh. <laughs> well, I have all get long nails. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Speaking of nails, I just had a very terrible nail. I don't know if you saw it on my Instagram, but people did not believe me. Let me now explain what happened. I'm going to picture, I say I'm going to picture, I'm going to put up a picture of that nail up on the screen so I can see how unbelievable it looks so I, will, I went to make my braids ah god this is my braids here eh? I've never rocked it to its full potential anyways but I know I will I went to make zero any these are where they are bare I don't know <laughs> oh nice Abby I went to make braids Mm -hmm. 
I decided, mm. and then somebody came there. She was speaking to my hairdresser that, oh, at her own place, blah, 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 they do this, they do that, their nails are always this, they're always down. So she was talking about nails, basically. And I just, because I wanted to do my nails for a very long time. And I just thought that, ha, imagine, I didn't cover my second legs. It's like, <clears throat> it's like Bill Gates now sends me DM. Mm. So I turned my back like this and I asked her, Oh, do you do nails? Are you like a nail tech? She said, yes, now she can. And I showed her the new picture of the nails I wanted to do. I don't say, ah, this is what I want to do so that I'll be able to tie it. That's why I always do short nails. I said, yes, now, uh uh. Why not? This was the picture of what I showed her. I said, this is what I want to do. So this is what I showed her. It's like an ombre French tips, white at the tip. This is like my favorite nail to do. This one here. So I showed her this. I was like, oh, sure now. Sporting. We sat down and started doing the nails. Meanwhile, I couldn't see what she was doing because I wasn't wearing my glasses. And I just let her continue. Since, you know, she was really talking about how good her nails are before we started so i was like oh she's a professional but i saw that the what she was putting it wasn't getting to my cortical up and i was wondering that ah, is this a new style let's how do i think i didn't want to interrupt so i didn't want to interrupt her then after some time i saw that she started with the uh, nude color instead of the white color you know the white is supposed to be the first color at the tip then you put the nude so that everything will flush together and blend i saw that she started with the nude and i was wondering oh this is a new style but i have done that same type of nails that they started with the nude parts before so i just kept quite thinking oh it was the same style she was going to do only for me to see that she was very very clueless when she wanted to put the I'm so addicted to Clubhouse now. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Only for me to see that she was putting the white, like she was confused about how to put the white one. And I was like, I've entered one chance. Hmm. Excuse me. I know it's like this outside. Though. And I was wondering that, how is this girl going to correct this thing? Okay, let's see. And then she was about to put the transparent one. And she was still putting it on top. So obviously, the whole corners of my nail, like the whole cuticle of my nail was bare. There was nothing there. And she was filing it, telling me her file was not working. When she filed, fi filed it, she filed my nails for about three hours. I'm not kidding. I'm sweating because I enjoy this food. Anyways, she found my nails for about three hours and was telling me her file was not working good, blah, 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 that, oh, her file is blunt. And at this point, then, my head was already aching me because they were pulling my skull. I was braiding my hair. And my skin was already filed, too. I just told her to leave it big. And I didn't do that nails 15,000. I was just kidding. I feel it was 7,000. I give her 2,000 naira. She's not serious. She'll go back and learn how to do nails before she's talk, talking outside. Anyway, about Clubhouse. Since I left Twitter now, even before I left Twitter, Clubhouse has been an amazing app to me. I've met so many good people there. And it's a very good app because you actually hear human beings' voices. You know, they are not trolls or like other apps that are are faceless and voiceless most of them anyways so whenever i'm bored like this i just go to clubhouse listen to good vibes good news you know entertainment education there are so many rooms there that you can enter that will you know edify your brand and up your knowledge so Our next topic is marriage. Hmm. 
I was talking I was talking to my mommy I think two weeks ago and she was like ah so now I don't usually celebrate my birthday now she was even surprised that I celebrated this my birthday that she was thinking I was going to get proposed to <laughs> she said she was thinking they were going to propose to me <laughs> Mm. Wonders. First of all, I don't think I'll call people if I know somebody is going to propose to me. Do you do you understand what I'm saying? I don't know. For me, oh, I think I want a very very intimate proposal. I don't want people to be everywhere in that vicinity. If anybody is going to be there at all, it should be probably my parents my siblings, my family members, or, or my close friends, not people at my party. And then you're not proposed to me on my birthday and take away my birthday and turn to my engagement. Nah. Mind you, if you're wondering if this is meat, it's not to, it's smaller. <laughs> you guys, I'm enjoying this house, so. Ah, thank you, mommy. Thank you, daddy. So she was not like, ah, so when am I now going to get married? Ah, so that, mommy, it's when I see husband, I'll marry you. Abby, yeah, I'll marry myself, you know, I'll just go outside and say I want to marry any man on the street, oh yeah, I'll come. That's when I see husband, I'll marry you, and she should not be in a hurry. Ah. Like, did I enter school with my friends? No. I don't want to be with my age mates, no. I don't use my... I don't use another person's clock to look at my own time, so I beg. <clears throat> it's when I find husband that I'm married, that she should not be in a hurry for me. Hmm? God's time is the best because we believe in God. Also, then I asked her that, or oh, do you want me to? get married now like if you want me to get married the next one month two months mm -hmm. i'll marry there's somebody in fact there are people i'll get married now but it's meant to be back in your house in like six months time because we'd have divorced and i'm coming back here i'm coming back to this house because you know like i say another egg we'll see i'm about to eat she said oh, no 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 ah no me thank him yeah, yeah. so allow me when I see husband, I will marry. Mm hmm. So, don't rush me, I beg. Allow me to arrange my life small. I mean, I just graduated. So, like, I'm technically 22 or, or 21, self. So, I beg. I didn't get the head start like most of my peers did. Like, people I went to primary school with, I went to um, university like seven years after my. Um, peers went to university. So, um, I bet. Come on, I go I go So, here you do. Anyways, my food is almost finished, so this video is coming to an end gradually. And my goosey has finished too. I just many meat, meat, meat here. Ah! You cannot imagine how thankful I am. Be eating free food like this. Imagine if you eat this food inside Buka. <laughs> you won't know better. So, I've also been planning to go on a diet for like two months now. <laughs> and that diet is not happening. I, like, I have it planned out, I have it outlined. I'm even meant to film because somebody sent me money purposely to film that food timetable. And it would be very unfair of me not to film that. <laughs> Full time table, so I'm going to film that full time table. But the thing is, I have to be disciplined enough to be on that diet to film that full time table because that will be what I'll be eating. But for now, we eat egusi and eba. Not like egusi and eba is not even healthy, it's just the quantity. And I think I had a fine or fair amount of you know swallow. Also, my I don't do soft drinks again so i like to blend up fruits my 
smoothies are always you know replacing my what's it called soft drinks although i always have juices juice like normal box ju juices once in a while and i always shower my um my smoothie with dates that's the sweet dates so that my juice or my smoothie can be really really sweet so i think that's about it for this video hmm. as you can see my about finished well done with this video So this is just watermelon and pineapple two sweet fruits like i said that's where i get my sugar from these days i don't do refined sugar or soft drink so most of my sugar will come from fruits okay. thank you so much guys for coming to watch me eat and giving you my life updates so that's been the latest that's been happening in my life for the past two to three weeks now i think i was quite accurate like from after my birthday you know the videos i've been uploading were just okay i need to upload but but moving on from now i promise you i'm going to be more um, intentional about my uploads um most of you are requesting that i do or i continue my what i eat in a day videos and that also that also has to do with my own discipline Eh? I have to be very disciplined enough to eat those things. I'm doing what I eat, what I sorry, what I eat in a day. Also, I forgot to remind you guys. I stopped going to the gym because my gym is getting renovated. I fitness is taking over my gym. So when the renovation is done, I'm going to re-register with iFitness. It's going to be more expensive, but I'm hoping I will get better results from when I was going to the former gym before so for now so for now i'm not going to the gym i'm just trying to eat clean and that means i have to eat properly clean this time around because no exercise or the exercise i just did just work all right guys thank you so much for watching this video we've come to the end of this video and if you did enjoy this video make sure you give this video a thumbs up leave a comment for me in the comment section down below like i asked you what are your thoughts on that twitter ban hmm? and also the kind of videos you want me to film let me know in the comment section down below till we meet again all right hopefully this week fingers crossed i'll see you guys in my next video bye